Uh, well, we were supposed to proceed with the first trial proceedings, or rather the pre trial process, uh, but unfortunately, we got partial disclosure, what they call partial disclosure, <laughs> yesterday very late, and it was inadequate because there are just a few things they, they shared with one of our lawyers. Just post mortem report, medical examination report, and of course, the site sketch scene of crime. That is all, which do not go to the gist of the matter. The real evidence we wanted is yet to be shared with us, and that's why now they have requested for more time. By Eighth, they put in an application to see the witnesses who need to be protected and those who shouldn't be protected. And uh, we reluctantly accepted that, considered that, and said, okay, fine. They will also come, let's wait. Uh, of course, you know what our clients are going through. They are on demand. They have not been tried for close to a year now since they were arrested. And we want an expeditious trial. That's where we are assisting. The disclosure should be made as soon as practical, it should be, the process should be expedited. And that's why we ask for stringent timelines. And we are glad the judge accepted and said by this, they should be fine. And by 11, we should, we should, we should be here. And the process should be concluded, not later than 18. We hope they will abide by those strict and stringent timelines that have been given in the interest of justice. And again, as I conclude and allow my colleagues to come in, uh, in fact, some revelations which have been made here, which are quite interesting, the, 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 the kind of evidence and testimonies coming out. Uh, You've heard the, the testimonies from the court the persons regarding what they went through, tortures, kind of. Which they were subjected to in the form of um, in, uh, so many things that were done to them as they were trying to extract confessions from them and also to implicate our clients that is the honorable surgeon and the honorable surgeon. They wanted that kind of accomplice evidence, we call it accomplice evidence, so that they, uh, they pin them, they implicate them with these murders. But we are glad that uh, the truth is coming out. These people have spoken out to their mind and gave damning revelations that indeed were tortured, that they were subject to that kind of inhuman treatment for purposes of extracting evidence. We actually not out under the Anti Torture Act, and we hope and pray. Let me put it different actually. At some stage, we shall seek for. The indulgence of court to ensure that those who subjected them to this kind of uh, mistreatment and torture and whatnot be brought to court. Because under the anti torture law of 2012, those heinous crimes cannot go unatoned for. There should be individuals to be held accountable for whatever they did uh, for purposes of extracting evidence. And we shall have to deal with that. Because it is quite, it feels quite a lot. We need to deal with that at some stage. Um, but in a way, it brings in a new dimension to the matter. Because you can clearly see what the state has been doing to get our clients implicated, and also for purposes of extracting extrajudicial statements or evidence from them in our clients, and of course. Uh, uh, again, the, the kind of torture we condemn, the torture that we subjected to those court because it's really unacceptable, it's despicable, it's abominable. Thank you. And of course, maybe I should add this, we highly suspect the reason they, they don't want to disclose evidence. That could be the reason. 
if we indeed they had that concrete evidence which they have been gathering for over a year now, would it be going into this kind of narrow ground where they are going to take post here and where please disclose evidence, please disclose evidence and be hide and seek games. They should be putting it on them. So now it's coming out to you why they are not able to disclose. Could be that reason that they expected it by force through torture, through coercion. Thank you. Uh, you can find the one of Maribiza pre trial, later pre trial process. Black of Jersey State Wedina, we get the bread. Nayera, which are almost to part and Kilakuanga. While a Napua Joe bag is a book for the Napoleon to the Valley, several were dumb of faith. Nanga, who don't know where. Actually, we will never come to the medical examination reports as a post mortem reports. Nature and scene of crime, Bruno, who began a sketch map of scene of crime. Nay, Javagan, the kitchen you see your evidence in the two taga, the Rumika about the fit, Dana, the Bakola, Chief Yokuta, about one. Even they say if Chajagala, you have to get a medical, talking of where I'm working on Lamba, go with Julius Ogo. Bakuanga <laughs> Kwa <laughs> Ndanga <laughs> Chimachavra <laughs> What Tocharing nineteen Seen the state has been playing hide and seek in this case. So we wanted it to be clear. But when they came back on the eleventh of August twenty twenty two. We should know the actual documents that they are going to present to court and what exactly they are going to bring on table 
the motor car. Because as you can see, the legislators have suffered at the hands of uh, the state. So basically, that's our request. And we hope that they can bring the substance of the evidence so that this matter can be expedited because our clients are entitled to a free, fair, and speedy trial. To Chirabienti, a Moabiba government, Alingata de Opusanyo Sanyo Musango Puno, Gatale Tabu to receive a yeni, Obina of Purumi Kababaka, Orfan Marocanti at a Gaza Fortin, Tiava yet a city civil, you are Timia yet a city civil. No natural Naku Warero, to what the Tuagalachi very clear and Tiba Kumina Rumo Bomana Bakuma court. Chichi cheva tule teda, eda chichi cheva cheva tagenda tule eta. Kumanga tuko yoko kwenye naga tuza nisi wabu zanyu, tuko yoko kwenye naga kabali mkomera, bato wali chitambula. Nola chotu wa gala, kukwe naga tulu wanila mazima no uwe nkanya, wanga fena, tuliba uwele za baba antu, ate tulu wanile vile peyo. Ok. Hmm?